Hello and welcome. I was consumed with rage after a sexual deviant, rapist and pervert was given six months sentence by a judge for the sexual assault on a 23-year-old young woman who lay unconscious outside a frat house. The UK Daily Mail Online reported that the police believe that the rapist, Brock Turner, took photographs of his victim's breasts during the attack and shared it with swim team friends who deleted it after his arrest. Were it not for the two Swedes, to whom the victim must be eternally grateful, Brock Turner's perversion may actually have won him more kudos amongst his swim team friends, one of whom asks, whose tits are those? But the letter to the judge about the pain that custodial sentencing would hurt Brock Turner so badly has irked the world except in countries like India and others where this kind of perversion is celebrated. The tragedy is that no level of public debate or outrage can undo the despicable harm he caused the woman while his parents are more concerned about the evil they have raised rather than that he should be held accountable for his action. Well, Brock Turner's parents are no different from parents in Jamaica who have raised children like him. They know their children are wreaking havoc and creating mayhem. They will mortgage their houses to defend their criminal offspring. I am sure you will all remember the famous case here a few years back. It is true that jungle law thrives in countries where there is no justice, and Jamaica is one such country. Until we find justice here, one love.